Uh, uh, Chris Froome, Alberto Contador, Richie Port. These are the three favourites of the Tour de France this year. And we have Chris Froome's just got to launch these motherfuckers off his wheel. All right, Chris Froome's a heavyweight. Look at that, Contador's in the attack. Not, so Chris Froome's in the attack, Contador's responding on the wheel. Richie Port's moving up, Roman Bardet grinding at the back there. Froome's like, come on, motherfuckers, let's dance. Let's motherfucking party. Froome Dog clicks it up some more watts. Contador's gritting his fucking little Spanish teeth. Looking back, seeing who's on the wheel. He's nervous. He's cracking. Boom, he explodes. Larry Lactate hits the cars. Roman is going back. Dan Martin's trying to come across. Dan Martin looks like an anorexic Lance Armstrong. You can see Contador in the yellow pop off the back. Frooms is going up again. Richie Port's like, come on, motherfucker, wait up for me. We did the best time ever up the Colder Maladone. We've even beat Lance. I'm your mate. Hold up. Dad Martin. Boom. Contador. Boom. That shiny S works. Tarmac looks pretty good. It's got a matching SRM colorway. Contador's out the saddle. 75 cadence. Richie Port's out the saddle. 67 cadence. Frooms on their 95 cadence saying, come on, motherfuckers. Hold that wheel, bitches. Hold that wheel, Lance Armstrong wannabe, not wannabe, Lance Armstrong doppelganger. Even rise like Lance, Dan Martin on, their, on the anorexia program. Chris Room going, all right, motherfuckers, let's go. Look at Room. Look at the Froome dog. 12 kilos heavier than Froome. Uh, sorry, <laughs> I'm getting all excited here. Froome, 12, about 12 kilos heavier than Port. They're extra bikes, extra weight. Froome's spinning, he knows the extra mass, he needs to use the cadence up there, the photographer's flashing that zoom lens. Froome's like, did you get Port's Grimace in the background? Because I'm going to launch these motherfuckers again. Look at that Contador, one of the best dopers in the world, can't even hold on. Yates is coming across, Yates should have been more aggressive. He's just following wheels, now he's going across, good work, good move. Roman Bardet's on the front, just lactating through his teeth. For the tips of his teeth, he can feel the lactate dripping onto his tongue. Condor's on the edge of that Pro Logo saddle. They're both on the Tailmac S Works. Custom paint jobs for the both of them. And Dan Martin looks like Lance Armstrong, coached by Duranor. That's how Lean Order got Lance Armstrong. Chris Froome got the extra weight, extra mass. Richie Ports having a move of recovery. Froome's probably like, yeah, my old mate, I'll let you sit on my wheel for a bit. But in the end, mate, I'm going to launch you off the fucking stratosphere, off that Pinarello F10 rear chainstay. Froome's like, come on, pull a turn, mate. Fucking, it's not Tasmania. Pull a turn, you soft fuck. Get off my wheel, cunt, is what Froome's trying to say. Now, I think in the Tour de France this year that Froome has no competition again. Richie Port, Alberto Contador, star riders, Dan Martin, the eight star riders. There's no doubt about it. These guys have physiological prowess. They're super light. They're jockeys on their carbon bikes. But Froome just has the cadence. He has the physiology not so doesn't have the physiology has the physiological training capabilities that adaptive thermogenesis, adaptive mitochondrial efficiency, that he just kills everyone on the climbs after three weeks. And he's gonna launch these cunts in the TT. He's gonna smash them to fucking bits in the Tour de France. There's, he's got his white jersey. So he's got even gonna be cooler. He's wearing a black jersey which insulates the heat. So Chris Froome's going to be even cooler in his three-week stage race. He's going to fucking smash everyone. Mark my words. And this Delphine is just proof. This is great HD content we can see here. As Kiawatsky just popped. Froome's making these guys look like fucking amateurs, man. He's going to make Port look like an amateur any fucking day now in the Tour de France. He already has in the opening stage. Port's one of the best riders in the world. Froome, look at this cornering. Just fucking railing it. Look at that. He's put a... A two bike lengths into Port, who's a really good descender. Froome's just like, I don't give a fuck. We're going to go in this corner. We're going to crash or we're going to fucking win. And look at these guys. This is three guys in the den who still can't even get them. Look at that. Froome has got crazy bike handling skills now. They used to call him Crash Froome, and now they call him fucking Sir. They call him Daddy. Daddy Cadence. Daddy Long Legs. Look at that throw of the bottle there from the Cannondale Drap Packer item. Super 6 Evo High Mod Mitsubishi Electric. That video caused a bit of controversy. Some people don't have a sense of humor. Here we go. Look at that spin dry washing machine cadence of Froome. Port's on the cadence now. He realizes if he wants any chance, he's got to clear those fatigue metabolites from his legs, clear that lactate, because Daddy Long Legs Froome's going to come past on the inside corner. Look at that. Look at this. Look at this. Look at this. Oh my God. On the inside. You know, inside of the inside of a professional cyclist, pro GC rider Richie Port just getting cut inside. Froome's going to go on the inside again. I'm not sure what's, what Froome does in the bedroom, but it looks like he's got to go deep inside. Look at that in the corner. And he's just going to spin. 
Richie pour off his wheel. This is a 10, 12 kilo heavy rider dropping the pure climber, Richie Port, just dropping him. Richie's out the saddle. Now Froome's going to get out the saddle and just say, motherfucker, see you later. Show him a clean pair of heels. Lick that, motherfuckers. And Chris Froome is going to just look at that. Launch it. Good ride by Port. Good ride by Port, Dan Martin. Good ride by Yates and Condor. But no match. For Chris, Daddy Long Legs Froom, that cadence. He practices that cadence like an OCD and actually teenage girl counting calories at fucking Walmart. He's going to kill him again this year. He's going to crush him. He's going to crack the fucking bottom bracket out of that Pinarello and it ain't going to be worth much on eBay. Bardet coming across. You've got to learn to spin, motherfucker. You've got the good physiology, good build, but Chris Froom, the heaviest motherfucker of all these motherfuckers and still smoked them all. Spin to win. Spin to win. Look at that. Froome is taller than... He looks, he looks, he's like the heavyweight boxer amongst the welterweights. 